Hey YouTube, this is Just19812 here. Um, I'm making a video about um, well, how to overclock your Samsung exhibit 4G or or in general any um, Android device. Um, you know, um, I found this application not too long ago. Um, System Tuner. Um, you got all this stuff here, you know, system backups, startups, computer times, etc., etc. Um, th this, um, before I even go to, go into it for this, you know, go into it, this phone or this application or whatever. Um, you know, Samsung Exhibit 4G. Um, me having it, I mean, it has been slow, and man, you know, um, it has been, you know. You know, it hasn't been going fast enough because I'm um, not now. I just noticed when I have this application, when I found it, I noticed um, Samsung Zipic 4Gs are, you know, underclocked. And, you know, it's not, they don't, you know, they don't make the phone set to the maximum speed, you know. So um, I felt this application is useful, you know. So I'm um, going tweaks. This shows just the info. I mean, you don't gotta pay that much attention to that if you don't really want to. Um, this is where you know this is what I'm talking about. This is I, I can't say this is overclocking, but kind of technically it is. But it's basically just maxing out your speed of your any of your Android, def, you know, what I'm saying phone. Um, don't mess with the bottom one. I think that's just a startup speed. Um, if you put it to if you put that to full, it, it will slow down and just the setting will go back to you know 100 megahertz. So um, the max is I the max is Samsung Exhibit 4G. I think processor or ROM speed or whatever. I think processor is a gigahertz. So uh, I do recommend just max it out, put it to a gigahertz, so I can have more variety of speed and space. You know what I'm saying? To work around with applications. You know. So um. It's another, that's another good performance. I mean, that's another good tweak. Um, I recommend there's um I think SB the car reading tweak. You you know when you boot it up, it, the um, reading is much more faster going that. Memory tweaks enable that. I think force all computers online. You can enable that. I just enable that for the sake of it. Clear catchy and most importantly, well I believe another good tweak too is boost app loading so when going to app it does boost it much more faster and that did help, help a lot I just did that. you can just use the catchy size you could just it's the six or something that's so you could I think it's bound off is good or bad or not um so you know this I really don't know so I didn't mess with that but I I can say you probably put that to max or any speed you want um memory just shows you what Probably have like a better understanding with applications that's you know shoot what that's working or whatever or something. I don't know. But um auto queue. This is a useful this I believe this is useful. Um ever since I set this up or you go to preset or you know light, aggressive, you know, etc. You know, um it kills it kills memory automatically and this one truly works. It does it automatically ever since I set this all up. My um, ROM hasn't been, you know, besides all that, but it really hasn't been all that full. So um, it's basically the ROM limit or whatever. So um, it works fine. It doesn't really, honestly, since I over I um, overclocked the phone, you know, it doesn't. These applications that run and does it, it's not messing with the the CPU. So um. Yeah, um, I got this off off of Abrob. I think, um, you know, uh, Airplanet is still down. Um, I do blogs. You know, um, I'll show you on my mobile phone. I do it on computers, whatever. Um, I'm trying to show you my wrong. I mean, my blog real quick. I uh, say so you should check it out. Um, even though my um. Yeah, even even though my YouTube videos is progressing more faster than my blogs are, um, I mean it, it. I mean, don't view it. You you probably do best just probably um viewing it at um 
on the, on the computer because it sure doesn't look all that good on on my Droid. I mean, when it comes to YouTube links, but um, there is also I forgot to tell you guys. Um, there is also um, I think for Abra an update for um, Modern Combat for, for Droid. I think 1.1.1. I'll, I'll go and show you guys anyways right now. Um, I tried it, but um, some reason um, it has this little issue saying uh, what? Mm, I forgot. Uh, can I save profile each time you go online? But I think that's probably only just because the Samsung Exhibit 4G is not really supported for it. But you know, um, you know, you know. I mean, for other Android devices, I. I mean, on here now, I mean, I know it probably not going to lag anymore once I, you know, once you try playing it, but, so, you know, um, like you said, 1.1.1, is so, uh, you guys should check that out, too, you've had some Sibby Sam Exhibit 4G, um, hopefully you guys have better luck than I do, when it comes to that, I touch you, I mean, I mean, excuse me, tweaking. But uh, you checked out my videos. I teach you how to, you know, download it off that app and all that. So, with that being said, you know, stay, t you know, um, stay tuned of my YouTube. I'm trying to work on my blog, blogger or whatever. Um, it's not, not all that easy, but um, st stay tuned, YouTube. Um, hopefully, you enjoy my videos. Um, have any issues or problems just you know message me and box me or comment on my videos and I will try to help you uh, so um, that's pretty much it peace